Hallelujah. Think about your language. How do you talk? How do you relate with people? What's your communication like? Choose the right words. Don't use words that beat down people. Don't use words that hurt people. See, choose your language. Think, what's the best way that I can communicate with this fellow without destroying his self-image? Without destroying his personality? Without making him feel sorry for himself? You know, sometimes there are those who think that if they talk to us and make us feel bad about ourselves, they got a point. No. No. In Christianity, we build the other person correctly. We build him. We build his self-image. We we'll let him know he has value. He's a person. He's worth the blood of Christ. We don't destroy that personality. We build it. So what if the fellow is this and that? It doesn't matter. That's between him and God. See, some people have very terrible language. Every time they open their mouth and talk to somebody, they think, if I talk to you, you never forget. <laughs> you, I like to talk to you in a way you will never forget the good things I said. See, I, I decided that many, many years ago, what kind of life I wanted to live. What kind of language? I can't produce bad language. Can't come out of my system. It's not possible. No. I can't produce such language. Can't come out of me. Why? Because I put my mind in the word years ago and began to train my mind to think right. You know, I, I would pray to God. I would say, oh, Lord, I want, to, I want to communicate correctly the love of Christ, the grace of Christ. Help me do it right. Preaching the gospel is not just when you talk to a sinner. You preach the gospel with your life every day. Doesn't matter who you're talking to. The gospel is Christ alive in you. Christ has come. And Christ is in me now. That's, that's the message every day. Continually, that's the message. Hallelujah. So train yourself to say the right thing, to use the right language. The word says, be cautious, be pitiful. That means be considerate. Hallelujah.